Hello year one, here is your art lesson this week. So I've been making, I've been making something and in this art lesson I'm going to be making the face. Can you guess what it is? I'm going to show you, are you ready? It was the very hungry caterpillar. So this lesson we're going to be making the face and we're making it the same way that the author and illustrator Eric Carl made the hungry caterpillar. So I can show you how he made it. Okay, so he's a very clever man and what he did, he can make his own tissue paper. So he has watercolours and he can paint his own tissue paper in different patterns that he likes. Because if you look closely at the book, it's not just green, you can see bits of yellow and you can see different shades of green and that's because he painted his own tissue paper using different greens and yellow. Now, I didn't have any watercolours, so what I did was I found tissue paper which was already dark green and light green. So if you have that, you could use that in the house. If not, I was thinking you could colour paper in different shades of green. So what he did was he coloured a big bit of paper with dark green and light green and then he would cut them out in the shapes that he needed. So when I made the body of the caterpillar, I followed the shapes really closely. Can you see? I tried to really follow the shapes. I was making big ovals and smaller ovals. So what shape will I need for the face? What shape is red? It's an oval as well, isn't it? It's not quite a circle because it's stretched. It's an oval. So I'm going to have a go at copying this. I'll show you how I did it. Now, you can either trace over the face or you could try and copy the shape. I think I might copy. Okay, so I can see that this bit here is round and here is a straight line and another straight line. Let's see if I can copy that. Okay, so it goes round. Here is a straighter line. There's a bit that goes here, look diagonal line and then we go straight and we join up. Looks a bit like a moon. So I'm going to cut this out now. I'm following the lines really carefully. Following the lines. Here we are, now I have my face. So it's the straight line that joins up to the green. So I need this straight line here to join up to the green. Oh, there we are, it fits. So I need to glue this. Now, Eric Carl uses um, pet paste when he glues it, but I just have a glue stick. I'm going to glue here where I want the face. There we are, and stick it on. I want to glue under here. There we go. And now I need his eyes. Now I've already cut out circles. I noticed that he used yellow and green. So there's a bigger oval. That's the yellow. There we are. And then I need the green on top. It's a bit fiddly because they're quite small. There we are. So I'll just need to glue that down. And then what I could do is get some coloured pencils and I could follow all these lines on the outside of his body. And then I could get some black and I could draw his feet and make his ears and then I've made the very hungry caterpillar. What do you think? Do you think you could have a go boys and girls?
I'd love to see what you've made. Send us your photos in. Bye.